In order to start a YouTube channel, many people assume they need expensive photography equipment, a team of assistants and bucketfuls of confidence. Not so. Don't underestimate the power of simplicity. There are so many YouTube channels that are shooting their footage just using a phone on a tripod and pointing at their hands. The technical aspects can be really simple, but just always bear in mind your audience and what they're on YouTube for. As this chart shows, generally they're here to solve problems, learn something and to be entertained in the process. If you want YouTube channel ideas without showing your face, then go watch my other video which I'll link at the end of this and also in the description. But if you want to know what tools and websites creators are using to make those amazing videos, then watch this one. The aim of this video is to fill in the gaps and show you the technical side. You can then choose whatever works for you and go apply that to any niche that interests you. Now the main thing you're going to need is a video editor. This is where you assemble your videos. You cut out the bits that didn't make the final shot and you add in any special effects that enhance your video. Don't worry if you're not technical though. Most of these are super easy to learn and if you get stuck there's an abundance of tutorials on YouTube. Personally I like to use Wondershare Filmora. It cost me something like $70 as a lifetime purchase and it's great. But there are free options such as DaVinci Resolve. Try a few different editors and find which one works best for you. Next up is your audio. Now a lot of channels that don't show their face are created by people who also don't want to use their voice. So instead of using their own voice they've got three options. One is to pay someone on Fiverr or Upwork or any freelance site to do some voiceover work but that could get expensive. Number two is to just use music and grab your royalty free audio from sites like Ben Sound or even the YouTube audio library itself which is pretty extensive. Or number three, if you need an actual voice, then use an automated voice. There are questions over whether YouTube is clamping down on the old fashioned robot voice. And in my opinion, generally, I think it sounds awful. But luckily, the software out there is improving constantly. So if you haven't already, then go and check out Speechillo, which is probably the best I've seen so far. It's got a range of voice types and it's far more realistic than the usual methods. I've added a link in the description. Next up is Vidnami. It's a great tool that can be used to automate video creation. You paste your script in and it'll go and look at its video library to find useful stock videos and photos and then display on-screen text. Now you do have to play around with it a little bit to make it look just right but it takes a lot of the hard work out of it for you. Ultimately it's the age old question, do you have more money or more time? There are loads of tools out there that can help you create videos quickly but they come at a financial cost. If you want to trial Vidnami, I've added a link in the description. This is exactly how sites like Natural Cures have grown to be huge YouTube channels that don't ever show their face. But what if you want to do all that manually? I've just shown you a way of creating automated videos, but what if you want to do the same thing for less cost? A little like some of the mindset channels and motivation channels that are out there. So if you've plenty of time on your hands, you can do this manually just using your video editor. You're going to need some good stock footage. Check out these websites for free. But also, if you're a Canva subscriber, then they've got tons of really good video footage as well as other great features that you can get with Canva Pro, where you can download the media and upload it to your chosen video editor and process it exactly how you like, adding in some music, audio, on-screen text, whatever you choose. Now this is the part where I jump in and ask you to help me out. I would really appreciate it if you give this video a like and if you're an entrepreneur who needs some help simplifying tech and growing your online business then subscribe to my channel where I create tutorials and how to's on some of the best digital marketing software available. Number five on our list is animations. Now there's so many options. Personally, I've tested Doodlet and Videoscribe and it's Videoscribe that I'm using for this video. I really enjoy the creative aspects, but there are others out there. Generally, they require a monthly subscription. Now animations can be a great way of telling stories and keeping people entertained. There are a lot of people that sell their animation skills on various freelance sites as well. So you could try and cover your expenses by doubling up as an animator for hire and create videos for other people too. Now some YouTube channels are literally just using slideshows, again Canva is a great option, it's got tons of ready made templates but you can also use Keynote or Google Slides which are free and add your info and facts about your chosen subject. Remember how people use YouTube to learn something, solve problems, bear that in mind. You can create your slides and they maybe mix them up with some stock footage, some music, some voiceovers, tons of different options. 
So my channel is becoming more tutorial based, like a lot of other YouTubers too. There are so many different apps and software available, people will often choose one and then create videos based on that software. You show people how to use it and potentially you also earn additional money by using affiliate links to the software. To achieve this you'll need a good screen recorder. In other words, whatever's on your monitor, on your laptop screen at the time, you're recording that. Now my video editor, Phil Mora, doubles up as a screen recorder, however, OBS is an extremely powerful open source app that will cost you nothing. There's a steep learning curve initially, but it's extremely capable and a free way to record your desktop. And as a bonus, here's a little Chrome extension that I absolutely love, and it can be really useful if you're using slideshows and tutorials. It's called Page Marker. If you click on it, it allows you to then interact and draw on the screen as you go, so you can illustrate your point and emphasize the bits that people need to know. Often with YouTube, we get hung up on the niche and the subject without thinking about the technical aspects. With YouTube, the world really is your oyster, and if you really don't want to show your face, that shouldn't stop you from becoming a YouTube creator. This is a real shame because YouTube is a great platform for creating additional income streams. Getting monetized for ads isn't a quick process, but there are other ways to make money with YouTube. If you watch the next video, I'm going to show you how.